So you've completed the main storyline, you win the tournament, you save the day by defeating Eternatus, and you finally take down Leon and become the most powerful champion that Galar has ever seen. Congratulations, you just completed one of the best storylines in Pokemon history, but the fun doesn't have to stop there. There is so much more to be discovered in Galar, so I put together the ultimate list to make sure that you did everything possible in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Make sure to watch the entire video, and if I missed anything big, be sure to leave a comment and let me know. Now without further ado, here are 32 things that you can do post-game in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Starting out with number 1, complete the legendary quest and catch Zacian or Zamazenta. Number 2, collect all of the rare lead cards. Most of these can be collected during the legendary quest. Number 3, get the Master Ball by going back home after beating the game and the professor will show up to give it to you. Number 4, get the free Charmander that is sitting in a Pokeball in the middle of Leon's room. This Charmander has the ability to Gigantamax. Number 5. Get the Oval Charm by beating Game Freak designer Morimoto in a fierce battle. He is located in the hotel in Surchester. Number 6. Get the Catching Charm by talking with the director. He is located right next door to Morimoto in the Surchester Hotel. Number 7. Rematch the Pokemon League. Number 8. Beat Leon in the Battle Tower and obtain the ability to judge Pokemon IVs. Number 9. Reach the max rank in the Battle Tower and obtain the Battle Tower uniform. Number 10. Get Type Null in the Battle Tower. Talk to the girl on the left in the lobby and she will give it to you for free. Number 11. Teach one of your Pokemon the move Steel Beam. This move is the most powerful Steel type move in the game and is extremely useful. Number 12. Catch all Gigantamax Pokemon available in the game by doing Max Raid Battles. Number 13. Complete the Pokédex. There are 400 Pokemon in total. Number 14. Get the Shiny Charm from the Director after completing the Pokédex. Number 15. Get the Beast Ball by talking to one of the merchants in the Street Market. The Street Market is located in Stow on Side. That's a weird name, but okay. Number 16. Collect all of the rare Pokeballs from the Ball Guy located in each gym. Number 17. Obtain the Ball Guy's rare lead card by talking to him outside of Motostoke Stadium. Number 18. Collect all of the TMs scattered around Galar. Number 19. Buy at least one of each TR in the game. Remember, these break when using them, so I suggest buying multiples of each TR. Number 20. Breed perfect IV Pokemon and build the ultimate team. Number 21. EV train your ultimate Pokemon team by buying vitamins from the Poke Center located in Winden. Number 22. Get your Pokemon to level 100 quickly by participating in raids and obtaining EXP candy. Number 23. Collect all of the rare candies and evolution stones that respawn every day in the wild area. Number 24. Obtain the lucky egg from the restaurant in Holberry. Number 25. Buy up all of the clothes and merchandise for your character. Number 26. Collect your free mystery gift. You'll be able to claim Gigantamax Meowth as your gift until January 15th, 2020. Number 27. Collect your free Gigantamax Pikachu or Eevee from the guy inside the Wild Area Train Station. Now keep in mind, you must have Let's Go Pikachu or Eevee saved data on your Switch for this to work. Number 28. Rewatch the in-game credits by going to the Holberry City Lighthouse. You cannot skip the credits, so only do it if you really like in-game credits. Number 29. Shiny hunt for your favorite Pokemon. This one can take some time, but finding that shiny will definitely be worth it. Number 30. Compete in online battles with your ultimate Pokemon team. Number 31. Complete the Curry Dex. And finally, number 32. Customize and update your lead card and share it with your friends. And there you have it. Those are the 32 things that you can do post-game in Pokemon Sword and Shield. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like this. But guys, I'm peacing out for now. Have a great day, great night, wherever you are. And until next time, peace out.